Hello, everyone. Bonjour à toutes et à tous. I'm Dr. Theresa Tam, Canada's Chief Public Health Officer. I would like to begin by warmly welcoming all incoming students. You're joining an exceptional community of healthcare professionals here in Canada. I'm joining you from Ottawa on the traditional and ceded territory of the Algonquin and Anishinaabe people. As a next generation of healthcare providers, you play a role in promoting diversity and inclusive, culturally safe and trauma-informed care. So I encourage you to take any opportunity in your schooling to learn more about reconciliation, how to decolonize health systems and the importance of self-determination for First Nations, Inuit and Métis communities. You are the beginning of a rewarding career where you have an opportunity to specialize in a field that is meaningful to you. As we have all witnessed, being a healthcare professional today has taken on a new meaning as we navigate and live through these extraordinary times. Nurses and healthcare workers as a collective are invaluable to keeping people and communities healthy and well. I'm in awe of the incredible resilience and dedication shown by nurses throughout the COVID-19 pandemic. The pandemic has highlighted the complex interaction of social, cultural, and environmental factors, and how these shape health outcomes and drive health inequities. As a result, some populations have faced disproportional health impacts from COVID-19, including older Canadians, women, racialized communities, people with disabilities, and those living with mental illness. My advice to you as the students of today and healthcare professionals of tomorrow is to maintain an equity focus in the context of your studies and your work. Nurses are the largest group of regulated health professionals in Canada. As nursing students, you can help to define how health professionals and this country approach and address the unique needs of the different populations we care for to ensure everyone has an opportunity to reach their optimal health. One of the most direct and immediate actions we can take is to identify and address the barriers to accessing care. We can do so by focusing on eliminating stigma and discrimination from the health and social services that we offer. Across the healthcare and public health sectors, we must do more to protect those who are most at risk of negative outcomes. This will make us a stronger and more resilient society and ensure that we are better prepared to face the complexity of future health threats, including, for example, the wide ranging health impacts of climate change. The pandemic has tested both the public health and healthcare systems like never before. It has also demonstrated the strength, determination and grit of our healthcare providers. I'm thrilled to see so many passionate individuals like yourselves striving to become health professionals we need your creativity, ingenuity, and drive now more than ever as we look to strengthen and enhance healthcare capacity. I look forward to seeing where you will take us. Nursing is a career that deserves great respect, and I admire all of you for choosing this as your path. I wish all of you the best of luck in your school year and the journey ahead. Thank you. Merci. Miigwech. Thank you.